name is Tyler Oakley, and I am so excited because today we are having a very special edition of the Tyler Oakley Show. It's time to celebrate Frozen! Oh my gosh. <laughs> today on the show, we have special guests, Anna and Elsa themselves, Adina Menzel and Kristen Bell. There's laughter, there's crying, there's hugging, and I'm here a lot. Um, so, enjoy! I am joined today by the very special Kristen Bell, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for having me. Of course, my pleasure. I am a huge fan of you uh, and everything you do, but my nieces and nephews are obsessed with you for Frozen. And I thought you were going to say House of Lies. But House of Lies, actually. They're huge fans. Yeah. <laughs> Is there any news we can get about the Frozen sequel? I wish there was, but I don't actually have Don't lie to me. I'm, see, I'm dead serious. House of Lies, I'm right here, right oh, now. What we have been doing is we're doing an Olaf special next year. Oh, my God. And we have recorded music and dialogue for that. I am so yeah, ready for that. There has been so much like fan-made things about Frozen online, yeah. and there has been speculation on the internet about Elsa potentially being a lesbian. Uh, Can you confirm that? Whatever Elsa wants to do, okay. it's up to her, and it's up that. to us to support her. And Olaf, That's obviously, it also is... Well, for sure. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I identify as Olaf, actually. <laughs> <laughs> because you have achieved my dream of being in an animated movie, uh, I thought we'd play a little game that is uh, testing our knowledge of characters and who voices those characters. Okay. First up, do you know? Yeah. Oh, I know. I know, too. Let's say it at the same time. Okay. Three, two, one. Jonathan, Jonathan Taylor, Taylor Thomas, Thomas, who I was in love with. Of of course. Of course. That's how I knew I was Olaf Oriented. Are we oh, playing? Shoot. Yeah, sorry. Mila Kunis. Dang it. Okay. Oh. Angie Lansbury. Oh. Alan DeGeneres. Okay. Who is it? Adele Gazine. I'm just going to let you ride this wave. Who don't you know? Amy Poehler. Wow. <laughs> Eddie Murphy. Thank you. I needed one thing. Oh, Wayne Wilson. Wow. Even a car. Chief Carell. I'm just... Chris <laughs> Oh, Tim Allen. Joe. Uh, thank you. Nathan Lane. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Angelina Jolie. Oh, thank you. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, James Earl Jones. Thank you. Gosh. Mm, you know. Ray Romano. <laughs> John Goodman. Kevin <laughs> Nett. Yeah. Oh, mm -mm. oh Ed Edgar. <laughs> you don't have to hit me. You clearly won. I, I, I didn't think, know I was going to be so good at that. Honest to God, I watch a lot of cartoons. My, uh, I guess my favorite thing now is just seeing you scream celebrity names while shaking your head. <laughs> that, I think, should be your brand. Um, yeah, that's beautiful. <laughs> I wanted to take a little moment to talk about something that you do that actually is helping save the world. And that's these granola bars. Yes. I want to talk about them. Tell yeah. me everything you know about them. Well, um, my, one of my best friends, Ryan Devlin, came to me with this idea of why isn't there a give back on food items? Mm -hmm. So he and a couple of us created this company called This Bar Saved Lives. It's so good. The cherry chocolate is my favorite. This is dark chocolate cherry sea salt. But this one... Madagascar vanilla almond and honey. And if it's warm a little bit, like if you happen to accidentally leave it on the uh, dashboard of your car, uh -huh. it tastes like a rice cream. And then cream. like ice cream on top. Uh, for every bar you buy, we donate a life-saving packet to a child in need. And we just passed our million-dollar mark. So Amazing. So we have been responsible for helping save the lives of 8,000 children. Well, thank you so much for sharing this with us. Thanks for playing my little game. I loved it. Frozen! Today, I am so happy because I'm joined by an all-time fave. We have Adina Menzel, everybody! Yay! Thank you so much for joining Thanks me. Thanks for having me. It's my first time on your show. Oh, I'm so honored for you to be here. I need you to know. To be here with you Thank means you. a lot to me. From a drama kid. What would you listen to? We sang for good at my graduation. You did? Uh huh. That's I would, nice. Like, were you Glinda? I was all of the characters. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that when you were on stage for a long time, something particular happens to you. You face a little issue if you're on stage for a while. Wait. Uh, this is I where found on my the Donald Trump. I was just about to go like, <laughs> you like start sniffling with Donald Trump now. <laughs> Where'd you get it? Um, I, uh, what were we dying? We were talking about when you're on stage for a Oh, yeah, while. I pee in my pants. Yeah, that's what I heard. Yeah. <laughs> Is it true? Yeah, it's just like, I don't know, it's a genetic. 
Isn't it a full situation? My mom, my situation? sister, and I, is it a full situation? Like, is all well, of the bladder? Yeah, well, ever since I had a child, okay. perhaps it's even a little worse. Oh, gosh. But when you're doing eight shows a week and you're drinking water all the time because you're singing. Oh, my gosh, yeah. And if you're, sense. you know, a lead role and you're mm. on stage for a long period if of time. I can't wait for the, the first time I pee show. my pants on the show. And I'm going to, like, <laughs> run off. Oh, and come on, you know you do. You're going to get me an ad, like a commercial for Depends or something. That is a brand deal. It depends. If you're watching, call us. So you are not only known on Broadway, Frozen is a huge hit. Is Elsa a lesbian? <laughs> can you confirm? Can you deny? I cannot confirm or deny. I figured you would If I tell it. you, I would have to kill you. I think in Frozen 1, she was young, and so she's still, you know, figuring, figuring out. out stuff out. If Elsa were to have a girlfriend, any Disney character. Oh my gosh. We got Pocahontas. We got Ursula. This is such a good question. Anybody is. Ursula. Well, love is love. You can't. You can't help who you have a connection with. Like Tinkerbell? Oh, Tinkerbell. <laughs> That's cute. You know what? I ship it. When Christine Bell was here, we played a little game called Your Face Rings a Bell. She dominated. Oh, really? I knew nothing, apparently. Oh, I'm not going to know a lot of this. Okay, so okay. that might be an even match. Okay. Are you ready? You should get the album now. It's in stores everywhere. Uh, I would get a physical copy so you can have it in your car. Isn't live your that best a novel life. idea? A physical Again, copy? Cake so is so really good. So really pretty, like, the lyrics are in here. I opened it. I was like, does, I thought this was going to be Does anyone your age ever actually, like, look at yeah, people like this it, and enjoy this experience? Like, oh, look at the lyrics. I can really see what you're seeing. And the bonus pictures. And, oh, look at the pretty pictures. I like this, this one is giggling. Nice experience. Oh, wow. Just go download it. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> get it anywhere. And uh, thank you so much for joining okay, us. This was so much fun. I love those two ladies almost as much as I love Frozen, which I love Frozen a lot. If you like this episode, go watch all of our past episodes of the Tyler Ripley Show. We have episodes with Kerry Washington, Celine Dion, Seth Rogen, and we have new episodes on Ellen Tube every single Monday. Thanks for tuning in, and thanks for supporting the show. I love you. Okay.